Welcome everyone to our prayer video, dear friends of the Savior Father channel. Today, together, we will delve into the powerful words of Psalms 91 and 23, finding comfort, hope, and inspiration in the promises and comforting presence of our God. May this moment of communion and reflection spiritually strengthen us and lead us to a peace that surpasses all understanding. Let us embrace this sacred time of prayer and meditation, fully trusting in the protection and loving guidance of our Heavenly Savior. May the words we share in this space be like balm to the soul, renewing our strength and restoring our faith. May everyone feel at home in this place of worship and seeking the Divine Presence. May the peace of the Lord be with us as we unite in prayer. Welcome to our moment of connection with the Heavenly Father. May He richly bless us in this spiritual encounter. Amen. I want to talk about the importance of daily prayer. Praying is connecting with the Divine, seeking guidance and comfort. This moment of pause brings peace, reduces stress, and promotes self-awareness. Prayer reinforces our values, gives us strength in difficult times, and reminds us to be grateful, cultivating a positive attitude. Incorporating prayer into our routine brings discipline and stability. I invite you to make prayer a daily practice. May it guide us and bring us peace. Amen. Today let's pray together with Psalms 91 and 23, seeking a moment of deep connection with our faith and the higher power that guides us. Prayer is a sacred moment where we open our hearts, seek guidance, comfort, and renew our hope. As we recite these psalms, let us allow ourselves to feel the protection and peace they offer us. Let us gather in spirit and faith, and let these sacred words envelop us, bringing serenity and strength to our lives. May prayer connect us and bring us peace. Amen. The spiritual journey we begin today is an opportunity to deepen our connection with the divine and find renewal amidst the trials of life. If you are facing emotional difficulties, health challenges, or financial issues, this is the time to seek support and guidance through prayer and meditation on the sacred words. Psalm 23 offers profound comfort and a vision of God as a faithful guide. It assures us that, with the divine presence, we will never be left unsupported. In times of tranquility and turbulence, God provides us with an environment of peace and renewal, guiding us through adversities with wisdom and care. Even when challenges seem insurmountable, Psalm 23 reminds us that God is by our side. He supports us, strengthens us, and gives us courage to face any situation, offering a safe refuge amidst the storms of life. Now let us turn our attention to Psalm 91, which is a powerful declaration of protection and security. This psalm assures us that, by seeking refuge in God, we will find impenetrable protection against the visible and invisible dangers that surround us. Psalm 91 emphasizes that God is our refuge and fortress, someone we can fully trust. He promises to deliver us from traps and calamities, and to cover us with His constant love and protection, ensuring our safety at all times. As we face risky situations, Psalm 91 gives us the assurance that God is always present, even when danger seems imminent. Divine protection is a promise that even in the face of adversities, we will be preserved and cared for. By reciting these prayers, you are seeking divine intervention to transform the areas of your life that need help. Pray for closed doors to be opened, for financial difficulties to be resolved, and for any challenge you face to be overcome with God's assistance. Drinking a glass of water after prayer can be a symbolic act of acceptance and faith, representing the renewal and spiritual purification you desire in your life. This simple gesture can serve as a constant reminder of the divine presence and provision. I recommend dedicating a period of seven days to this prayer practice. The number seven is a symbol of fullness and completeness, and by engaging in this process you will be allowing God's blessings to manifest abundantly in your life. As you conclude your prayers, offer gratitude to God for His constant presence and support. Believe that, even when answers are not immediate, God is working in your life and preparing a path for you. Sharing this message with those facing similar challenges can be an act of great generosity. Prayer has the power to unite in comfort, and by sharing these words of hope, you will be bringing relief and encouragement to others. God is an inexhaustible source of strength and comfort. By keeping your faith strong and seeking His presence through prayer, you will be opening the door to new possibilities and opportunities for growth and healing. As you face difficulties, remember that prayer is a powerful tool to transform your reality. Trust that God is by your side, 
ready to guide and protect you in all circumstances. God is attentive to your needs, and His responses may come in unexpected ways. Keep your mind open and your heart receptive to the ways He may be working in your life. May the peace and serenity of God envelop you and your family, bringing comfort and security at all times. Trust that the Divine Presence is active in your life, promoting healing and restoration. As you conclude your prayer practice, carry with you the assurance that God is hearing your petitions and responding according to His perfect will. His protection and blessings are guaranteed, and you are always under His loving care. May you experience the fullness of divine blessings and may your life be marked by a deep sense of peace and confidence. Continue seeking God's presence and trusting in His power to transform every area of your life. Lord God, in you we find refuge and strength, our safe shelter and our peace. I trust in your constant love, which covers me with your wings and protects me from the storms of life. You are my shepherd, and I shall not want. In green pastures you make me lie down, leading me beside still waters. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me your rod and your staff. They comfort me. Your love is my shield and protection. In every moment of uncertainty you are my security. I cast my anxieties and fears upon you, knowing that you uphold me and give me strength to face any challenge. Your Holy Spirit guides and directs me, bringing clarity and wisdom to the decisions I must make. Each day, you are the light that illuminates my path, and I trust that, in you, I have found true guidance. Your presence is my peace, and in moments of distress, it is your voice that calms me and gives me hope. Even if enemies rise against me, I know that you prepare a table before them, and your anointing endows me with strength and courage. Your goodness and mercy follow me all the days of my life, and dwelling in your house is the desire of my heart. When I feel surrounded by dangers and uncertainties, you are my security, the firm rock on which I stand. In every step I take, you are by my side, and your love never leaves me, giving me confidence and courage. Your promises are my anchors amidst the storms, and I trust that you will always fulfill what you have promised. Even when darkness seems to draw near, your light shines in my life, dispelling any shadow of doubt or fear. Your grace is sufficient for me, and your strength is made perfect in my weakness, bringing me hope and renewal. Your protection is unshakable, and with confidence I rest assured that you are always by my side, guiding me and caring for me. In every challenge you are my safe refuge, and with faith I trust that no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Your presence is a constant comfort, and even in moments of loneliness, I feel your companionship and eternal love. Your justice prevails in my life, and in you, I find assurance that all things work together for my good. Even when the world around me seems to crumble, you are my firm foundation, sustaining me with your power and love. Your faithfulness is a testament to your unchanging character, and I trust that you will always fulfill your promises in my life. Your goodness is a never-ending spring, and in you I find the daily renewal I need to live fully. In every season of life you are constant and unchanging, and your love for me never fails, sustaining me through all circumstances. Even if fear tries to overwhelm me, your presence is my fortress, and with faith I face any adversity. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path, guiding me with clarity and truth. In moments of weakness, I find strength in your power, and with your help, I overcome any obstacle that arises. Your peace, which surpasses all understanding, guards my heart and mind in Christ Jesus, bringing me serenity and confidence. I trust that, in your perfect plan, everything has a purpose, and even in difficulties, you are shaping my character and faith. Your mighty hand holds me and guides me, and with your help I move forward, knowing I am not alone. With each new dawn I find renewal in your grace, and with gratitude I offer my praise for your infinite goodness. Your love is the anchor of my soul, and in you I find assurance that my life is secure in your hands. Even when the path is uncertain, I trust that you are directing my steps, and with hope I move forward. Your word is my guide and my support, 
and each day I find wisdom and direction in your teachings. In every moment of worship I feel your presence and love, and with joy I celebrate your greatness and mercy. I trust that, in your goodness, you will turn every difficulty into an opportunity for growth and learning. Your peace is my shelter, and even amid the storm, I feel your constant protection and care. Your faithfulness is a solid rock on which I build my life, and in you I find stability and confidence. In every challenge you are my ever-present help, and with your assistance I face any adversity with courage and faith. Your love is my foundation, and with confidence I rest in the assurance that you are always by my side, guiding and protecting me. May your presence be my comfort and joy, and in every day of my life may I reflect your light and love. Dear God, At this moment of prayer I come before you with gratitude and humility, lifting up each listener of this prayer to you. You know the hearts and needs of everyone here now, and I ask that you surround them with your loving and protective presence. Lord, may each person experience your deep peace, which surpasses all understanding amidst their worries and anxieties. May the certainty of your care and confidence in your promises be a constant source of comfort and strength. I ask that you illuminate each person's path, providing clarity and direction in their decisions and challenges. May your words, like lights on the path, bring understanding and wisdom at every step. May all feel your protection and security, even when the winds of life seem contrary. Surround them with your love and may they know they are safe in your arms, regardless of what they face. I offer my prayer for healing both physical and emotional. May your restoring hand touch each person, bringing relief and renewal. In moments of pain and weakness, may they find in you the strength and comfort they need. Lord, help each one find joy and gratitude in the small things in life, and may your goodness and mercy be evident in their daily lives. May they experience the fullness of your grace and the beauty of your presence in every moment. I also pray for protection against any negative influences and for the strengthening of faith and hope. May your unconditional love be a beacon in their lives, guiding them to the light and driving away any darkness. May they feel the encouragement and support of the faith community around them, and may unity and love be reflections of your will in their relationships. Finally, Lord, bless each one with a deep sense of purpose and fulfillment, and may each day be lived with the confidence that they are fulfilling the plan you have for their lives. In the name of your Son, Jesus, I pray and trust knowing that you hear and answer our prayers. Amen. Lord Father, as we conclude this moment of prayer, we want to lift our grateful hearts to you. Thank you for allowing us to be together here, connected through faith and communion with you. May the words of Psalms 91 and 23 continue to echo in our hearts, bringing comfort, hope, and spiritual strength. May we fully trust in you in every moment of our journey. We ask, Lord, that you bless each person who participated in this prayer meeting their needs, comforting their hearts, and guiding their steps. May your peace, which surpasses all understanding, be with us in every step we take. And now, dear friends, if you have been blessed by this moment of prayer, I invite you to subscribe to our channel, leave your like, and activate the notification bell so you don't miss any of our content. May we continue together on this journey of faith and spiritual growth. Until next time, may the peace of the Lord be with each one of you. Amen.